I've been reading uh, Effortless by Greg McKeown. Uh, he has another book called uh, Essentialism, I think. And uh, in an interesting way, right, life is super busy and we have so many different things to do in our business and we have so many things to do in life. And he really speaks to, you know, it's important to not only simplify things and get to the meat of what matters and the most important things, um, but also to, you know, have and keep a positive attitude around all that, right? It doesn't have to be difficult. What is maybe a way that I can make this easy or effortless, he goes on to say. Something that's really come out of that for me is in looking at all of the things that I'm trying to do in business and in life, what are the things and what are the activities and what are the to-dos and what are the tasks that are going to move the needle forward, so to speak, on my vision versus what are things that are just maybe fun or, you know, keeping me busy or frankly not important towards that vision, right? And so I've really started to look at all the different things that I'm doing, asking the question, does, will this actually move the needle forward or is it just busy work or is it just a distraction? And uh, then going from there clearly, right? Things like reading and endlessly checking our email all day, every day is not going to move the needle forward. And yet, you know, we are, you know, dopamine addicts scrolling and looking for good news or some big thing to happen or, you know, maybe a proposal to get signed or, you know, winning the lottery or whatever. And those things never come, you know, via email anyway. And so why are we spending, you know, probably a full hour throughout the day, if not a couple, you know, doing something like email, right? So this week I've literally stopped checking my email. I'm going to check in once, maybe twice a day answer what needs to get answered, move things along and move on because uh, frankly, it's a distraction and it's not moving the needle forward. Well, he said it in the book. He was like, so I've tried to find ways to like pair not so fun things with like different fun things. He was like, came back from a vacation or something from time off or time away and had like voicemails. And he's like, oh, I got to return all these calls. I got to do all these calls. How can I make this fun? I'm going to sit in the hot tub and call everyone back. And he like made it a joke of like, hey, John, how you doing? I'm in the hot tub. Ha, 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 ha. And then like they would conduct their business or right. follow up or whatever it was. And yeah. then he moved on. Because oftentimes we look at all of the things in our life and it's like, if it's worthwhile, we, we assume or we make it hard. This is going to be difficult. This is going to suck. Um, but yeah, how can we kind of make it effortless? How can we make it fun and exciting to do the things that are important to move the needle forward. And, and it's all about the vision, right? Moving the needle towards what? The vision. You know, I've just started reading Effortless and this week making just some subtle adjustments and it just changes your mindset instantly, right? How we get to choose how we look at everything, positive or negative, right? And then we get to choose, frankly, especially as entrepreneurs, what we focus on all day, every day. And if it's not things that are you know, bringing us joy or we can get joy from. And if they're just things that slow our energy down, sap us, you know, suck, then get rid of them. And you can make quick and subtle adjustments in that. And, you know, you'll feel a lot lighter and faster. There's only a handful. And then I outsource that part too. <laughs> but like the rest, I'll tell you, like from my perspective in finances, the more you automate and make easy, the better, right? You do have to kind of keep tabs, yeah. but it's not like, oh my God, I got to pay the rent or the mortgage. It's like yeah. auto magic, auto magic, auto magic. And like with direct deposit and, you know, even accounts that can like move money to different places or whatever, man, that makes that shit so much better. <laughs> <laughs>